think like the atmosphere in here is very different and it, there's just so much more playing for one another and uh, yeah absolutely we are playing for one one another and we're battling every night and um, you know what it's uh, it's fun it's it's part of sticking together it's part of a long season and guys rallying around each other so um, it's not not the game we want to play we want to play a fast skill game but um, you know we're not afraid to stick up for each other and and uh, you know it, it, uh, it's it's working for us right now the Kings are kind of in the bottom of the standings this season but they're coming off a huge win how are you guys going to hinder their momentum um, I think just uh, right off the bat, matching their intensity level, obviously. Uh, I think setting the tone early in our home building is uh, is big for us, and getting the crowd involved early is definitely something that we want to do. And um, I think just taking away their time and space, and you know, I think we've been playing really good hockey lately, so just sticking to our game plan and doing what we do. Coming off a loss, what are you guys going to do differently tonight? Um, I think just you got to put that one in the past. Uh, we had some good chances to win that game, but you know it's over with now. We got a game tonight, and I think uh, everyone here knows uh, knows what we have to do to win. I, they got a lot of good players on that team, and a lot of big bodies that you know can move pretty well. So it's uh, you know it'll be a good game. I think uh, you got to take the space that they give you when it's there because they do a good job of t- you know closing it in and. Uh, I think if we just play our game, we'll be okay. With, with uh, Dylan, um, you know, choosing his uh, the way he responded the other night and uh, kind of the stuff with the Colorado game, how maybe beneficial is it just to his game that opponents know he has that kind of edge to him? Well, I think you gotta you gotta opponents have to know that you're gonna stand up for yourself and your teammates. I think it's, that's a huge thing. Uh, uh, early in his career, if you remember back to my, my first year here, his first year, I thought I thought a number of teams took run, runs at him to try to test his toughness. I don't see that anymore, and you don't see that anymore because they know he's tough. And uh, not that he's gonna make a career out of fighting, and nor do we want him to. Uh, but but the fact that they know that he's got toughness to him means uh, he'll get un- enough space to be able to create. Offense. Some of the guys talk about how they're having a good time. Are you noticing the kind of the learning curve of learning to have fun and also be successful at the same time? Yeah, and I think it's important uh, to uh, to enjoy it. You know, it's a it's a long. First of all, you only get so many uh, games uh, in a year, and you only get so many years in the NHL, and you better enjoy every second of it. Uh, uh, you now, it's not fun to lose. The best enjoyment's winning for sure. Um, but but winning with camaraderie is there's nothing that can replace it, and I think it can build your team uh, to a, to a whole nother level. So I've certainly seen our guys, you know, uh, building that camaraderie. Sometimes you do that through sticking up for each other. Sometimes you do that through coming back and tough, uh, finding ways to win. Sometimes you do that through fighting through adversity like we did for the first part of the year where uh, we didn't win for for a long time. So, you know, I think all those things have helped build our camaraderie and I think we're a better team with great camaraderie. Is team speed your biggest weapon against these guys? Uh, Well, I think we're we're a team that a lot of teams we play, we can be faster in them. I think if we don't, I think the bigger thing than, I think this gets missed a little bit it's about playing fast more than anything else. You can have team speed and not play fast, and then you're not fast. And you can have average speed and play real fast, and you are fast. And, and I actually probably learned that from Willie Desjardins as much as anybody else, to be dead honest with you. Um, we better play fast. If you don't play fast against this team, they will grind you down, and you will get no scoring chances. And we've done that before. I think we sat in Joe Louis Arena, had 16 shots or something, because we didn't play fast. And so we better play fast tonight.